Level 1.2 Level 1.2 is one of the sub-levels of Level 1. To access it you need to break one of the lights, and there is a small chance that a hole will appear, leading to this mysterious level. This floor has only been accessed and explored by you slash epic doge bear and an unnamed person so information is limited. General Description Level 1.2 appears to be an abandoned mansion that was built in the 1800s, with a forest outside that seems to span forever. It is always snowing and yet the snow never piles up to any more than 3 feet. Windows are commonplace and they're all like the one seen in the photograph. All of the doors leading to the outside are locked, and the rooms seem to continue on forever, with more and more doors, windows and rooms appearing everywhere you go. No matter how many stairs you climb and descend, you will always be on the second story of the mansion. The mansion is filled with many different rooms and passageways that seem to be for servants. It is not suggested to enter this level if you have claustrophobia. Very rarely you may enter a library filled to the brim with books. The library room will never be any bigger than 50 feet by 40 feet and is always 30 feet tall. The spines of the books on the shelves are designed in a way that when the books are placed in the correct order, they will create a picture. A common theme with book spine designs are landscapes with the occasional geometric pattern. The walls are all old blue wallpaper walls that are peeling with the occasional white wallpaper. The floor, in the rooms that still have a floor, luxurious pine hardwood remains over the wood chip baseboards, even throughout the servant passageways. Even though the hardwood is torn up or greatly chipped and damaged in some places and rooms, no spare or removed planks of hardwood have been found. The hardwood also seems a great deal harder to tear up than any other hardwood, having been both glued and stapled into the wood chip baseboards. Spider webs are very common, in corners of the floor, ceiling and doorways, although no actual spider seems to be here. The only entities confirmed to be here as of now are the passive form of facelings, which are unique as they're dressed as maids and servants and are cleaning and dusting and sometimes bring explorers food and drinks which they call snockies. They will tear you around and are actually very helpful if you're polite. You slash epic doge betty also said that he hears barking, which is a sign of another entity that may be exclusive to this level. Hallway Description The hallways of level 1.2 are plentiful, some rather unintriguing, while others unique. The hallways always have a blue or white wallpaper, although longer hallways with more doors usually have the white wallpaper. The floors can be the wood chip baseboards or the thick planking of the luxurious hardwood. What makes each hallway unique is that the height, width, curvature, rotation, and slope is always different. Sometimes hallways can force thoughts upon you. The most notable of these you slash epic doge betty describes in their journal. The Matterhorn, described as being rough with no hardwood planking, this hallway is roughly 1,270mm tall, 1,230mm wide, it's always turning in on itself with many hairpin turns, and with a changing uphill slope varying from 18% gradient to 56%. Our explorer describes their attempt at climbing the 56% gradient as imagine this, you're stuck in a water slide, that's a square tube that rotates at random angles and has strange nonsensical twists and turns and you're trying to climb to the top while the people at the top throw tear gas that makes you think about just letting go and seeing where you end up. Eventually, the explorer reached the top and went on his way. Colonies and Outposts There are no known outposts here, due to only a few people visiting it for now. How to enter and exit To enter, break one of the lights in level 1. To exit, find a key and find a rare type of bedroom with a closet. The closet leads back to level 1, 